Hello everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to make the haunted house. So for this, the kit includes seven chocolate cookie pieces, including a ghost. Um, and then there's icing, two pre-made icing packs, bones, bats, jelly beans, and candy beans. So let's open it up. Alright, now we're going to start unboxing. Got to need this. Um, so let's take everything out. This is all the chocolate cookies. There's seven of them. So we're going to open the cookies. Okay, so now we have everything. Here's the little ghost. It smells like chocolate. Okay. Go. Let's try not to break anything. Okay. So first we're gonna start off at the base, which is this big piece right here. I'm gonna have to remove the plastic and then I'm gonna start icing it. So I have this and what we're gonna do is you're gonna first of course you have to knead the the icing for one minute. But I already did that, so let's open it like that, and then we have to cut it, um, but I don't have scissors right now, so meanwhile, need it. <laughs> okay, here we are. There we go. Alrighty, we're going to speed this up, and we'll come back to you after we finish icing the base. I just finished icing the base, I kind of got used to it. And so my tip is to just put it close to the square because there's gonna be a square right here. My tip is just to put it, the tip of it close to the square and kind of squeeze from the bottom to the top and move it um, and kind of got more fluid like that. So the next step, we're gonna take these two pieces first. Um, I think for right now we're gonna put this aside. And we're gonna ice this, these pieces on, on the sides only. Alrighty, here's a tip. Do it like you're squeezing the last of the toothpaste bottle and roll it down so that it can create more pressure here and it doesn't cause as much squeezing and it's, a, and, and it's less harder. So you kinda just roll it down and then squeeze. And then it goes more fluent, and it's more flowy. And then bam, you're done quicker. Okay, and now I'm already done. Um, make sure that you don't ice the roof though, because you're gonna ice the roof later. Kind of. <laughs> okay, so I got both of the pieces in the icing. Um, we're gonna put these aside. And then I'm gonna move the base. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab the base, which we did the first thing, and we're gonna put it so that the square is more on the left than on the right. And we're going to take the wall, like one of the window pieces, plop it on to one of the sides, and then one of the bigger pieces pop it on to one of the other sides, and then we're gonna push them together. Um, the icing is there to help. It's a bit hard, it's a bit tricky. Um, let's get it together. All right, so you might not need to ice these pieces and also make sure that you put these at an angle so that it's a bit like tilted like that and not just like completely straight, otherwise it's not gonna hold on very well. And it might fall a bit, but you wanna make sure that you compress them nice and tight on the on the floor and on the, on the base and against each other. And so let's put the other pieces. So remember at an angle like that because they're not completely straight. Now we're gonna put this final piece up um, and then you're just gonna let them dry while you ice the roof on. 
so you just compress it and it should hold. Um, when you have the three pieces on, it should already be holding if you did it right. Otherwise, you may fall. Make sure to put the walls at an angle once again because if it's straight, then that's not good because it's gonna fall. But so now that we have all of that on, it's time to add the roof. So you shouldn't have iced the top yet. Um, and so remember the tip from earlier? <laughs> um, put it like toothpaste and um, like it's an empty toothpaste roll and roll it down and then ice the top. So let's speed this up. I iced it. Um, so now we can add the roof. I have to check if it goes like this or like this. It goes like this. So make sure you put it like this. Um, but if you want to, you can put it like this because it's yours, not mine. But um, let's just whoop, put it on. It slides on pretty easily, actually. And there we go. And then you, you're gonna see this big gap, but we're just gonna fill this in with icing later. So now we're gonna let it dry overnight and we'll finish the decorations tomorrow. And it also snaps on pretty easily, so you don't gotta worry about any of that stuff. So yeah, see you tomorrow. All right, it's tomorrow, <laughs> except it's today now, because we're in the future. Anyways, um, there's one thing that I did realize. You see the side is a bit big, huh? I think I was supposed to turn my house and have the front face the bigger side. So make sure that you don't make that mistake. Um, but I guess I can put the ghost here because I guess we have a big patio. So now it's decorating time. And also, if you don't have time to leave this to dry overnight, you can do it for 30 minutes. It says 30 minutes on the back of this box. But we, we were kind of like, let's do it tomorrow. Um, so we kind of can just decorate it however we want. You can copy the sample if you'd like. But I think I might copy the sample, but it might be bad, so please don't follow my influence if, if I'm bad. Um, but yeah, let me start. Okay, so first we have, first, oh yeah, also make sure to cut the orange and make sure you needed the orange icing. Um, you should have needed both icings, I think I said that yesterday. I'm doing the top now, they just finished on the sides. All right, so I just finished the roof and I think I'm gonna do the roof first and then I'm gonna go down to the bottom and maybe do the sides. Um, but we don't really have that good of a view of the sides on the box, so I'm just gonna improvise, I guess. Um, but yeah, now I'm gonna decorate with the candies and we might just have to go around right here so that you don't see all the dents in the junior bed. And the bite. <laughs> yes, it's yummy. If you'd like to bite it, you can. I'm not saying it's illegal. Why would it be illegal? Um, but I think I'm gonna ice the sides, so I'll see you, like, not this side, but like the side of the gingerbread, and this side, and then we're gonna decorate, so I'll see you then. Alrighty, so I just did the sides. It took not too long to do that. Um, so now I'm gonna decorate it with candy. Um, okay, so I put some jelly beans, and some bats, and I'm gonna keep going. All right, so I finished one side, and um, only the first row I messed up on, but I bet I can switch them up. Um, I don't think I want to do that now, though, because I don't want to do anything bad. But yeah, so if you'd like to copy mine or the serving suggestion, but mine is technically the same as a serving suggestion, so just, yeah. Um, so now we're gonna put some bats on the roof, and we're gonna do the other side. Hopefully I have enough jelly beans for the other side, but I think I will. Um, they may have had extra jelly beans because, you know, they probably had more than a jelly bean thing in the house. So yeah, let's do this. Okay, so I just, let me just scoop that. Um, so I just put the mats on. It's really quick. It's pretty easy. Um, yeah, so now we're going to do the final side. There's no really serving suggestion for this side, so I'm just going to improvise beats. <laughs> Alright, 
so I did the whole roof of the gingerbread house. I think we're gonna start doing the, um, I guess they're called icicles <laughs> because they look like icicles. I'm not sure if they're icicles because you know, how would you, why would you have icicles in October? Unless you live in like Utah or Wyoming. Um, but yeah, so I think we're gonna start with the front and the back, I guess you could call this, of the house. So yeah, let's do this. I'm not sure if I'll be able to do this though. I did one window. <laughs> I did bad. I really did. But I'll see you when I did both the windows, I guess. Alrighty, we did the door and the windows. Um, we, we're gonna decorate it with some candies, of course. Maybe we won't do the bones because um, I think we may not have enough bones. Um, but the bats, I think we'll be able to do. Um, maybe because we don't have a lot of hats either. Um, but yeah, so we did this part. I think it looks pretty nice. Um, so let me go ahead and decorate that. I think instead of doing pink and green, I'm gonna do black and orange. Then, um, I don't really wanna put anything in between, so. Because I'm not sure if I'll have enough jelly beans, so I'll just put two pinks in between, or maybe just one pink. Yeah, I think one pink will work. Um, and then orange and black. So scratch that, since it's you mean the front of the house. I think we might as well use the jelly beans, but I'm still gonna do my window design. Um, but for like all the um. Um, this, the surrounding around the door, and that stuff, which I just put. Um, we're gonna use the bones and the bats. Same for the window, but I might not have enough room for the window because I did squish in the bones. Um, but, because, you know, it's the front. What, what else am I gonna use it for? Let me put the bats. Um, then bone, bone, bat. Scratch that about grabbing the bones. And there we go, and bone and bone. There we go. Yummy. Okay. Um, and then I just have this one window to do. So yeah. This is the front. Um, I actually think I did pretty good. The windows are a bit messy along with the door, kind of. Actually, I think we did pretty good with the door. Um, the design, of course, they're good because they're pre-made. But yeah, I think it did pretty good. So now, let's do the sides. I don't think we're gonna do the back, though, because we might not have enough stuff. All right, so me and my mom, my mom just did the windows, the sides of the windows, and I think we did pretty good. So now what we have to do is add the beads and then add the ghost. And I guess we're gonna have to add it here instead of here, but, well maybe we could do it here. Free icing. Maybe we could do it here, but I think we can do it here because we have space. I'm sorry if I'm saying here, 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 here a lot, but here. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I'm gonna do the windows. Um, let's get, yeah. Um, I'm gonna do the same pattern as these windows because they did the same pattern as those windows. So, <laughs> I look weird and I can tell. And so now we're gonna add the last bead because we did it both sides and then we're just gonna add Mr. Woo here. I named him Mr. Woo. Um, so here we go. That's one side and that's the other side. Um, so I think now we're gonna ice Mr. Woo and then add Mr. Woo onto the side. Um, so yeah, let's do that. Uh, if we have one. 
Okay, here we go. Okay. Um, so I ice him in black because that's how disturbing situation is done. And then we'll free icing. Um, so yeah, we did the ghost things to my mom. And if you need help of a parent, just ask them once again. Mom or dad. Um, so yeah. So we're just gonna attach the um, ghost, Mr. Ooh. And then when we finish, I guess we're gonna decorate the what we know as a side yard. Um, I guess front yards and backyards will be existing in this Halloween house. All right, so um, we just did the patio or the side yard, whatever you wanna call it, and the doormat. Um, you guys are gonna have like two times the room if you do the side yard and, and the front yard. <laughs> um, but so now we're just gonna decorate all of these sides or the side. Um, also, if you want to, you can let the ghost dry and then you can, you know, put the ghost there. Um, so we're just going to decorate it with jelly beans now. Um, the, the, the doormat or whatever this thing which it is. You guys are going to be able to put like four jelly beans on one side and I can only put two, which is sad. Um, green. Frick, we ran out of green. Um, so we're going to just... I'm gonna take a yellow. Um, so don't fall. And then one more since we have room. Those were two big jelly beans. So now we're just gonna um, do the uh, rest of it with beads or decorate. I mean, the rest of it. Beads. And you can do whatever colors you want. I'm not going to follow the swimming suggestion at this point. Uh, smiley face. <laughs> All right. Um. So we just did. This is a final project, actually. I have no clue why I said we just did. Um. But yeah, this is a final project. This is the side. We decided not to do the back. Um. This is the side yard, and then this is the front. Um. So if you have extras, you can just them because they're candy so why not um and yeah so get the roof the front roof side yard the other side and back patio so yeah this is a haunted house final project i hope you liked it Alright you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and if you didn't, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and also, don't forget to subscribe. The button looks a lot like this. Bye!